need to understand what you're getting into. If you're a basic private going to basic training, you have to understand that coming to basic training, it's not summer camp. Decided to go to the Army in high school. Wanted to join because I wanted to serve. Had a family history of serving during wartime. Just wanted to go and serve my country and to protect my home. Contemplating either enlisting, going to West Point, decided to enlist, enlist in the Mississippi National Guard as a 14 Sierra. Being in the Army, you meet people from all over the world. We're an Army that we attract. We attract people from all over the country and you get to know them and you get to spend time with them and you get to uh, create a friendship there and a bond. The biggest thing, like especially being a troop commander here and basic training, I want to be one of the primary ones responsible with training and preparing that troop to go out and complete any mission that our unit is given. Once you see that mission has been fulfilled, it's very life fulfilling. You just feel like you actually accomplished something. You actually did something that mattered and that you made a difference. If you want to be an officer, you have to be willing to commit to the service and you also have to understand that you're going to have to make sacrifices along the way. The most important lesson I've tried to instill in these trainees here is that what they're stepping into is they're stepping into a legacy. You have soldiers that some have put everything on the line. They have to understand that this is the legacy that they're stepping into and that it's something that they should not take lightly. I'm Captain Corey Nash, 19 Alpha Armor Officer, and I'll see you at GoArmy.com.